This chart looks a lot like the one in the previous video that was where we downloaded all of the data into the Jupyter Runbook and then by the slider just reformatted the data to display it. In this one, we're actually doing a live call each time to download just the data we need for the data, the time that was selected. So let's see how we built this. First off, if we work backwards up here, we create the plot. And when you create the plot, that's causing calling this replot the data. And when you replot the data, it's pulling fresh data from the pull fresh data function. And then it's just using the same plot function that we used in the last one. It's just creating a new plot for us here. Let's look at pull fresh data. When we pull fresh data, it's up here. We format the dates to get it from a time date in Python to something that Jira likes. We create the query, so we call that function to create the, the JQL query for Jira. And then what we can do is we can actually reuse the task we used to make the Jira call. And then in one of the actions above in this runbook, we reuse it and we just call it the Jira task two. And we send in the, the, the new um, input parameters and we get a new output. So we get the output and we put it into a dictionary. And then once it comes, once we've pulled the fresh data, we put it into data frame and then we make the plot. And there we have it. We've got a plot that is generated in real time. So if I come back here and we come out, let's change this slider to like August 24th, you can see it is changing the data and pulling a different bit of data. There's only one um, task that was closed in this week, but let's make it a little bit longer. And as it does the math, you can see that now there are 16. There were seven that were completed within 144 hours, four that were completed between 144, 287, and, and so on. And again, this isn't, these aren't outage issues. These are actually bugs that were in our system. So we're just using the data set to show you how you might do this for the meantime for resolution for your outage issues. Give it a try. This runbook will be available in our open source shortly. And we support panel in both our open source, which we're using here, which is built on a Docker build, and also in our free trial, which you can see at unscript.com.